Hi, and welcome to Wellness Wednesdays. My name is Tammy Hand, and soon you'll meet my colleagues. We work at the Peel Field Centers, which are part of Student Learning Support Services, which are part of the Peel District School Board. Hi, my name is Lisa Caffaro. We feel very fortunate to be working on the land where the field centers are located and love being connected to the outside natural world around us. Hi everybody, my name is Christine Chapel. Today on Wellness Wednesday, we would like to introduce an activity to you called Sit Spots. We'd like to share some of our favorite places. A sit spot is a special place that you can visit every day or whenever you feel the need to have some quiet time. It's a place that you can connect with the natural world and take a few minutes to unplug from the digital world. Choose a spot where you can sit and feel comfortable. This could be inside looking out of a window or sitting in a yard or a park. The place doesn't matter. The most important part is that you can pick a spot where you can see the natural world. If you can find a spot to listen, that would also be great. Everyone's sit spot is special to them for their own personal reasons. To begin, choose a quiet spot that you would like to try. Try doing this activity for five minutes, and if you're comfortable and feel good, you may choose to stay longer. Start off by taking five deep breaths. Inhale and exhale slowly. Inhale your breath down to your belly to the count of five. Breathe in as if you're smelling flowers, and exhale for five as if you are slowly blowing out a candle. Try to relax your mind and your body. Continue to breathe in and out slowly. As you breathe, look at the natural world. What do you see? What else can you see if you look even more? If possible, listen to the sounds around you. Cup your hands around your ears to make them bigger. Look all around. Can you see five things? Can you notice four different colors? Can you hear three different sounds? Keep breathing in and out. Is there something you feel connected to or are interested in to look at another time or go further? When your five minutes is up, slowly focus back on where you are. Stretch your arms and legs and slowly stand up. We would like to share some of our favorite sit spots with you now. Sometimes when I need a break during the day, I find a window I can sit at and look outside. I sit on a chair or on a cushion or sometimes on the floor. I look for a window that I can see nature through, even if only a tiny bit. This window is in my classroom at work. I like to call it my nature television where I can take a break from my computer and my phone or any other digital devices and screens. I pull up a chair to the window, get comfortable, and look outside. I breathe in and out, maybe even counting in my head a few times as I breathe. I breathe in, one, two, three, four, five. I breathe out, five, four, Three, two, one. I look around as I slowly breathe in and out. What is on my nature TV today? Birds flying in and out of the bird feeder. I filled the bird feeders up earlier today with black oil sunflower seed, which is good for the birds. I look at the trees. How are they shaped? Is anything hiding in them? I look at all the different colors I can see. Not just green or brown or blue, 
but can I see how many different colors of green I can actually find? I look at the sun, I look at the sky. If there's no sun, I just look at the sky. I look at the clouds and everything else that's in there. I look at the sun reflecting on the snow and how it glistens and sparkles. If I can open the window safely and without any danger to myself, then I can also listen to the sounds of the natural world around. Maybe birds, maybe the wind. Maybe you can actually hear the snow falling. I sit, I breathe, I look, I listen. I try my best to just sit quietly for a few minutes and let the nature all around me quiet my mind and just, just enjoy. One of my favorite places to do a sit spot is here underneath an apple tree at the field centers. We've set up a couple of bird feeders and the birds come in all the time. So we look, we listen, and we watch, and we see if we can bring in some of our feathered friends. Often when I start my sit spots, I like to look up into the treetops. Here I notice a little downy woodpecker. As I listen to the sounds of the other birds around me, I want to see who's nearby. Can you see the white-breasted nuthatch? I'm also joined by a little hairy woodpecker up in the treetop there. I love hearing the little fluttering sound of the chickadees' wings as they come into the bird feeders. I love to just stop, watch, and listen. Sometimes at my sit spot, I'll hold out my hand with a little bit of black oil sunflower seeds on it. The chickadees love these seeds. And quite often, once they get to trust you, they'll come land right on your hand. During my sit spot, I will often sit with my eyes closed. This helps me to really hear what's going on around me and to focus on the sounds that are happening in the treetops above. I make sure to take a deep breath in, hold it, and then a deep breath out. I'll repeat this several times while sitting listening.
As I finish my sit spot, I stretch and I give gratitude to the trees and the birds around me. I am sitting at one of my favorite spots here at the Finlayson Field Center where we work. This is one of my sit spots and I come to this place whenever I need a screen break or I need to clear my mind or I just need a nature break. This is where I like to come. This is one of my favorite sit spots because I like the wide open spaces. I like anywhere where I can sit and look up and see the sky above me. Whether it's a sunny day like today with clear blue skies or a day when there are more clouds in the sky, I like that wide open space. While I'm here in my sit spot, I'll get comfortable. I will take a few deep breaths. Just give myself a chance to settle in and really feel like I'm part of this place. And then I really start to make some observations. Really tune in to what's around me. I'll feel the warmth of the sun. Even on a cold day like today, it's warming the earth and giving living things the energy they need to survive. I like to feel the wind on my face or my bare hands or watch how the branches move or the clouds move in the sky as the wind blows them from one spot to another. I try to focus on how I feel sitting on the earth and really feel connected and grounded. I like to look around me and notice other things like animal tracks. Think who's been here before I was sitting here today. I'll notice the colors, how things have changed since the last time I was sitting here. And of course, I always try to listen to sounds around me. Birds in the distance, again, the wind, the sound it makes in the trees, or blowing snow across the surface of the ground. Try to listen to sounds closer to you. Listen to your own breathing. Can you hear your heart beating? Of course, you can visit whenever you wish. You can visit every day, once a week, once a month, or maybe every season. It's nice to see how your spot has changed from day to day, even at different times of the day. And to really feel like you're going back to a familiar spot, almost like visiting a friend. Look up, look around you, connect with this natural space, and just enjoy some time to yourself. This is one of the sit spots I've shared with you today where I like coming when I'm here at the Finlayson Field Center. I have others though. I have one in my community. I have one inside my home, right by a window. A sit spot does not have to be a place where you have a forest or a stream beside you. It is any place that is special to you that gives you a good feeling when you are there and helps you to connect with nature. Thank you for joining us today, everybody, at some of our favorite sit spots. 
I hope you are inspired to go and find your own place, that special spot where you can take a break from your busy day. My name is Christine Chappell. Please feel free to contact us at the Field Centers if you would like to uh, speak to us and hope you have a great rest of day. Bye everyone.